Welcome to this Blackpool Music School video all about the G tune dulcimer. But before we start, hey Google, what's today's date? It's Sunday, the 3rd of September 2023. So as you can see, I filmed some of these videos a little bit in advance. If you've seen the one posted yesterday, I taught you how to play in the key of A on a G tuned dulcimer. In this video, I'm going to teach you how to play in the key of D, delta. So, let's get started. If you've seen the previous videos, you know the delta chord, D. That's the key we're in, delta D. That's the first fret of the G string nearest your chin and the G string nearest the ground. Golf, we already know from the previous videos, that is the second fret of the strings nearest the floor or one string, some have two, some have one strings, I have paired strings, some only have one, that is golf G. And if you've seen the video yesterday, alpha A is at the first fret there. So you've got delta, golf, alpha. Now like I said in the video yesterday, some people think if a guitarist is playing D or a piano player is playing D or a uke player, mandolin, whatever, you have to play something differently. No, a D is a D is a D. So whether it's a piano book, a guitar book, a mandolin book, banjo book, makes no difference. A D chord is a D chord. If you can play a D, play a D. Okay, so this is a basic blues song in the key of D. So D is the first fret of the G string nearest your chin and the pair of G strings nearest the floor. So this is in D, we're playing four bars of D, like this one and two and three and four and... First bar. Second bar. Third bar. The fourth, two bars of G, golf. First bar. Second bar, two bars of D. Another bar of D. One bar of alpha A. One bar of G. Two bars of D. So that's the basics of a blues in D. Now, obviously, you wouldn't leave the gap. So we'll play it now as it should be played. We are counting one and two and three and four and, and it's four bars of D, two bars of G, two bars of D, one bar of alpha, one bar of golf, two bars of delta. So after four, one and two and three and four and one bar. Second bar, third bar, fourth bar, golf for two bars, back to delta, alpha, golf, the delta. And obviously you just repeat that cycle, that is a basic blues progression in the key of D. So you can there's a variation to this that I will teach you now. It's just the first two bars are slightly different. It's a bar of D. Then a bar of alpha. Golf sorry. Then back to delta. So the first four bars now sound like this delta Golf, Delta, the rest stay the same, two bars of golf, back to Delta, one bar of Alpha, one bar of golf, two bars of Delta. Some of you may have noticed when I was playing the golf, I was lifting my finger off the G string like this. I covered that in the previous videos. So now you've played a song in the key of D. Now, so like I say, if somebody's playing a blues 
in the key of D, you will need del Delta, Golf, and Alpha. You can play Alpha with one finger like that across all the strings. I just prefer to play it that way, like a guitarist and ukulele player will play. But by all means, if you have the strength, you can hold all three strings down with your first finger or middle finger. It's up to you. So if somebody's playing a blues in the key of D, you can now play along with them. So I hope you found this video useful. If you have, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to Blackpool Music School for more videos. The more thumbs up we get and the more subscribers we get, the more videos we will post. So until next time, take care, keep practicing, keep playing. And as always, after three, one, two, three, goodbye.